Hey y'all, it's good again. I'm barefoot, but not in the kitchen at the moment. I will be barefoot in the kitchen here in a little bit. Today we're going to make my, what do I call it? Hamburger pockets. I use tortilla, flour tortillas instead of bread. That way you can just kind of grab them, run off down to the lake with them or whatever. And you're not making a mess and wearing half of it. So first I'm going to grill up some hamburgers and then we're going to go inside after that and get it all put together. I was kind of a dumbass and I forgot to thaw them out first so they're still a little bit frozen but they'll still work. No worries. I'm going to put a little bit of the Lowry seasoned salt because, well, I pretty much put that on everything. And then some onion powder. Uh, also, I'm a dumbass and I forgot to take the thingy off of it. I'm not very prepared today. But anyway, a little bit of onion powder. And then the Montreal steak seasoning from McCormick because that's one that will pretty much go on any kind of meat and taste good. Okay, so now that we got all of our stuff on there, I'm gonna shut her down and let it do its thing. And we will check back in here in a little bit and see how they're going. See you in a bit. Okay guys, we are back and I've got the burgers off the grill. So I'm going to show you how I throw these together. Just get your favorite condiment like mustard or ketchup or whatever. Put you some on there. And you lay your burger down. cheese and then you just fold the edges over like that kind of like when you're making crunch wraps just like that make you a little little pocket and you're gonna put it out that's what <laughs> and then you're going to put it in the skillet just enough to kind of brown it it doesn't take very long at all and it's okay if some of the cheese comes out it's okay it still will taste good so it don't matter <laughs> and I did spray my skillet, the cooking spray, just kind of the insurance that they hopefully don't stick. <laughs> You can actually do these when you're out camping or anything like that, you know, if you're just wanting to cook outdoors. As long as you get something flat that you can put these on after you make the pockets.
sometimes when you get tor packages of tortillas, you always got those few that just aren't cut right. <laughs> They're still usable, though. I, mean, eh, I do have a little bit of stickage. Just make sure you don't burn it, because then it tastes funky. cheese isn't gonna like show or whatever and then you won't have the same problem that I just had. Theoretically. <laughs> but that's all you gotta do guys. And like I said I promise that's not actually burnt. The darker spot is just the cheese that melted out. But give it a try. Let me know what you guys think and I hope you enjoy. Y'all have a great weekend. Love you guys. Bye.